and one of the biggest avenues brothers be in no doubt one of the biggest avenues which leads to this now is social media because the Sahara the magicians they need a picture or they need an item of clothing or they need something to identify the victim by so that their shayateen can go and afflict them that their jinn and their sihr can go and take effect on that person and imagine you put your pictures of your family you put your pictures of yourself you put your pictures of your children you put your pictures of your possessions and you share your entire life online and I am telling you that this is so common in our society. It starts with jealousy. It starts with an impure heart. And a person, he's following this person and he's seeing this person's doing well, she's doing well. And the most absurd thing is that the youth today, they think doing well is having lots of followers on social media. Think about the stupidity of that statement. But they genuinely think this person's got 10,000 followers. This person's got 50. And they think that that is success in life. And in reality, those followers are more worthless than the dead dog on the street. But they think that that is success. So they get jealous. So they get jealous or she gets jealous of that lady who's so pretty and all of that stuff. And so they take the pictures. And they go to the magicians and they do the sihr. My brothers, we see pictures of husbands and wives who are newly ma married. And then the, we find them washed up and we see them in the magic. And the magicians have taken them and they've done their magic by means of those pictures which have come off social media. And so my brothers, if you have something, if you have a blessing, don't flaunt it. Don't flaunt it. Because the Prophet ﷺ, he told us that every possessor of a blessing is envied. Oh, kama qal sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So it's, it's very important if you cherish something and you cherish a blessing, enjoy the blessing of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in private. Enjoy that blessing that you have, make the most of it and do your adhkar.